Now let me take you back for a second or two Childhood raps take you back for a minute When times were more simple and you lived with your parents Before you went to college and you started paying taxes Remember these shows that you watched as a kid Childhood raps take you back Okay, you beautiful passengers It is yet another week and we are still at the home location I don't know exactly how I'm doing it But I'm able to watch Steven Universe at the home location And not in the truck And yes, as you can tell I've got a lot of stuff boxed up. Um, I was supposed to do some more this weekend, but Christmas activities and stuff like that. I'm probably just going to pay the people to come in here and just move the furniture themselves instead of me having that weekend to move the furniture and then to do the carpet and stuff like that. So, yeah. Um, so, if you ever want new flooring, just go ahead and have a flood in your house. <laughs> this has been going on for a couple months. Um, that's why there's such an echo. Because the piano is moved from the wall over there on that wall. And it creates a little bit of an echo that way. And the flooring is completely moved off the floor. Which means we have concrete floor. I do not like dealing with it this long. But I told the people who were supposed to do this for us, and yes, I know this is a rant not about Steven Universe, but, you know, it is what it is, right, y'all? But I told the people that are supposed to come in and do the floors, I was like, hey, why don't y'all just wait till after the holidays? I can grin and bear, you know, what it looks like until then. Yes, it's a bit of an embarrassment that we don't have a floor on our floor. It's not like we got, you know, had to watch where we step or nothing, because, you know, we got a concrete slab or floor at our house. But I was like, you know, just... Wait until after the new year, and we'll start fresh and do it then. We've already paid for the materials, insurance money came in, all that good stuff. So, one good thing about your house flooding, you get a new floor, paid for by the insurance. And thankfully, we have a company that's going to work with us and cut the deductible out. So, we ain't responsible for $1,000. So, cool beans, last episode... <laughs> Um, wow, what did happen last episode? We had Bluebird, which was the fusion of Ruby, Eyeball Ruby, and Aquamarine. And then we had a very special episode. And, of course, I don't think none of these are ultimately fillers. They were filler in the sense that they were there, but they were also not fillers in the sense that they were there showing just a little bit extra of Steven being pushed further and further. So... Yeah, I can't remember the titles to these episodes we're about to watch, but yeah, um, I don't remember the titles, so I don't know what else to say. Um, keep in mind, I am going to say this real fast before we start this, because I know I've been running my mouth for three, four minutes, and that's how it goes, um, but keep in mind that this is edited reactions due to the simple fact that copyright on YouTube with edited reactions, I feel like we are well within the law of fair use, so that's why we do edited reactions, and that's why everybody else on YouTube does edited reactions. If you find someone that ain't, you know, doing edited reactions, then I don't know how they're getting around it. So, yeah, earbuds, they're in. Let's drown this world out in three, two, one, and play. <laughs> Snow day. Okay. I was about to say this might be a sapphire episode, but I guess not. All right, little homeschool. What's on the docket for today? You can do it. Guess what we've got lined up Pup Copter. Pup Copter Sky High Adventure. And most importantly, pizza. Hey, that's what I'm going to eat after I've this episode. I've been for like a month. So wait, you're a vegetarian now? And I have my own okay. skincare routine. Anyways, it's cool. I already ate. Okay. Oh, well. So I'm well, presuming that this episode is going to be about oh, Steven I was not sure feeling like he's getting time. treated as the age that he is. <sighs> and the I'm crystal sure gems you, are thanks. wanting to reminisce and have the good old days back. See you at work, guys. <laughs> okay, dude, they're just trying to goof off for once. You're kind of getting a little bit. Nah, bro. Classic Steven. 
Garnet? Lose something? It's Cat Steven. I haven't seen her all morning. Oh, weird. Steven, you should check the cabinets. Oh. Uh, I like, I didn't mention it last episode, but yeah. I do like yes. that they switched huh? Rose's picture out with a picture of the it's Crystal Gems. Classic Rose. Crystal Gems. You know the rules. <laughs> Okay, dude, they're just trying to have some fun. You can't stay in there forever. Whoa. Well, I'm sure they... <gasps> okay, a little over dramatic. Oh, joke's on you! Pearl doesn't shapeshift! The power of Steven Tag compels me! Okay. Um... <laughs> Okay, well, this is the first time we had Steven Pearl. Steven, no! I just folded <laughs> Oh, goodness. Ultimate Steven tag. Confused? <laughs> wow. Hey, this is dangerous. Sardonic Steven? What the heck? Opal Steven? What the heck? Acquired. It's time to play Steven tag then, Steven. <sighs> Alexandra right, Steven. Whoa, that's creepy. Hey, Cat Steven! I heard that now. No way she can catch me here. You shouldn't have messed with me. <gasps> Sapphire Steven. Oh no. Do it, do it. <laughs> hey too, Cat Steven. <laughs> Okay, I'll do it. We're sorry. <laughs> I missed you too, guys. Steven, we're so proud of the person you've become. Yeah, that's why we want to hang out with you so bad. But if you need to get back to work now, we'll understand. Okay, can we please just okay. change back to who y'all are? Tag, you're it. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we have to update the game. Oh, gosh. Yeah, I love it. Perfect. You all better run. <laughs> Amethyst. Uh, let's see. Why so blue? Maybe now we'll have a sapphire episode. Okay. Nope. This shouldn't take that long. Yes. Most gems come around pretty quickly when I invite them to little homeschool in person. Uh, Steven? Um. So the rumors are true. You think they didn't get your message that we're not destroying planets anymore? I'm sure they huh. did. Everyone did. That's not what you just said a second ago. Why would we say Lapis got a point. Well, new Lapis has got a point. How can the thing we've always done just suddenly be wrong? At the very least, we've got to finish this world. We're almost done. 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 They're not nice like me. Uh. <laughs> exactly. They just don't understand that they're doing harm. I love what you, Lapis. What made it click for you? A cycle of horrible torture. But other than that, living in nature, getting creative. Yeah. Wow. Come on, we can do that for them. Okay, Way to get dark on us. Torture. No, just the other stuff. Fine. We'll try it your way. I say we go with Lapis's so, idea. Why don't we explore just a little torture? Do that don't mm -hmm. involve destroying worlds. Just give it a try. That's it. Try making other shapes too. Anything you want. Oh. Okay. Way easier That's a screenshot that I'm getting. Yeah, we can clear out this planet in no time. Okay, so you got the short hair lapis right there. Getting on your side a little bit. Okay, they both got short hair. Let's get back to it. 
Why so blue? So many shades. I understand copyright issues, so I'm sorry if I skip too much of the song, but by all means, go listen to this song. So much I want to do. You know, through YouTube or whatever, because it's probably so great. I'd love to see your color shining through. You know, I'd actually like to see lapis with some extra color, like how uh. Pearl <laughs> <laughs> has gotten more color about you her really as well. expect us to dance and sing like pearls? <laughs> Have you decided to give us a hand? You could say that. <laughs> Did she just do that? She did. Yes, she did. You really need to stop teaching us new things. <laughs> wow. Um, Steven, I think it's time. Oh. We really have to thank you for all the wonderful She is not going to like being Turns insane. Out totally useless. I kind of told y'all she ain't going to like being in chains. Oh, well, this is new. Who's dull now? Who's pitiful now? Oh. Okay, this isn't you, Lapis. Yeah. Hey, maybe we got us a new pumpkin. Granted, our pumpkin We're had done. passed. No more fighting. But sure, find maybe me. we got a new and pet. No more terraforming. You leave this planet alone? Uh-huh. After that ridiculous show of strength? I don't have the strength to deal with you. <laughs> oh, Lapis. Here's some brochures for our school in case you're interested. Uh, huh. so is this that school you mentioned? Yeah. Welcome. So we got one of them. <laughs> I like wherever I'm getting it from that I always end on a picture of amethyst sucking down a drink um okay so i am hmm how do i feel about these two episodes snow day i guess we might as well go ahead and tackle snow day first huh <sighs> snow day when i seen the title i thought okay maybe we got us a sapphire episode maybe she's upset or something and she's just you know creating a big old snowstorm and I, I at first I thought maybe Sapphire created the snow just to kind of get Steven to stop and just relax and play a little but by the end of the episode he was playing a new game of Steven Tag it's an older Steven Tag but it's still Steven Tag um but it was just you know it was just a regular old snow day you know they were snowed in and they wanted Steven to relax, and they wanted old Steven back, you know, someone who isn't constantly worried about what's next to do, and what are we doing, you know, we we'll, they were tired of adult Steven, pretty much. Steven's 16, but he's still taking on a lot of responsibility for a young age, and it's probably getting to him, and they probably saw, hey, you need to relax, dude, um, and... <sighs> <laughs> I just realized that I do not have my microphone hooked up, so there is no reason for me to even <laughs> be talking into this mic. Um, wow, I just realized that. Oh well, though, it is what it is. It happens. Hopefully the microphone on this thing will pick up the sound pretty good and stuff like that, and... Yeah, I, I, wow. Oh, well, stupid me. Um, <laughs> but yeah, Snow Day, eh, it was good. It was another one of those episodes that's showing us that Steven is really, you know, pushing himself to a limit and that he needs to relax. And then this episode we had, you know, Steven and Lapis. I want me a Lapis episode. It was a great song. And then, you know, these two Lapises, I mean, yeah. Um, I'm wondering about this, you know, this little, it looked like she had a little ponytail back here, but, you know, she's got kind of shorter hair. Um, I'm wondering if she's a good one, because obviously the other one didn't come with her. I'm wondering that if the other one 
is going off and being like, because if I remember correctly, on the intro where it's all the villains, we have three Lapises. Obviously, we got a good Lapis here. We got we got two Lapises. Um, we got our Lapis and this Lapis. So I'm presuming we're going to come up with a name for her. I don't know what the name is yet because I'm just watching this. Um, and then we have the other Lapis. I'm wondering if she's going to get more Lapises and then try to fight Steven in a future episode. Or are all these Steven, I mean, all these villains, because we got Aquamarine and Eyeball Ruby now, which is Bluebird. We got the Lapises. We haven't seen, we've seen Jasper as well. We don't know exactly how that's going to pan out. But we've seen all this stuff, and it seems like maybe Steven's, this wasn't really a Steven episode for me, the, the second half, so I don't know. Um, it's more of a, a observational episode for Steven is a good way to put it, I think. And Steven's observing that there are other gems out there that are not wanting to, you know, adapt to this life. Of, you know, hey, we ain't destroying stuff no more. This stuff is bad. And you had the other side of the argument, though, of, you know, hey, stuff we've been doing all our lives is now all of a sudden bad? I mean, what what's the deal here? Um, so I did like that argument. That was a pretty good argument. And, you know, people who have grown up believing that stuff, you know, what, you know, believing what they've seen has always been right, it are going to be confused as to, oh, goodness, you know, this is how I live. This is how I've been raised. And all of a sudden, it's wrong, you're telling me? Um, granted, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm in agreement with Stephen, but, you know, that's a good point of view and a good perspective for people to actually be able to be more understanding, in my opinion. But, you know, hey... It is what it is. Hopefully what I just said came out right and it doesn't I'm not sympathizing with them per se to the point where I'm like, hey, you know what, they're right. Um but at the same time it's like you gotta look at both sides of the perspective and just kinda get them to, you know, eventually, you know, get them to understand that look, you know, like race relations in the sixties when there was, you know, fire hoses being put, you know, on African Americans. You know, just because they grew up that way doesn't mean it was right. I mean, that was completely and utterly wrong. But a lot of people grew up back then thinking and being racist. And that was not right. They saw in their eyes, you know, that it was. Y'all know what I mean. I'm not going to keep going. <laughs> it's it's y'all's turn. Hit the like, tickle to subscribe. Don't be texting and driving. And... As Mr. Rogers always says, And I like you as you are. I do.